confront him or do anything. Yesterday, Lexington police briefed security officers at Keeneland about Kaposi. With horse racing this weekend, police wanted to make sure everyone is aware there is a fugitive on the run. A final goodbye today for a school destroyed by fire. Former students, faculty, and staff gathered at the site of the old Elizabethtown Elementary School in Whitewater Township. There's nothing but rubble at the site. The building burnt to the ground last Sunday. Today, former students shared memories they made at the school, saying even though the building is gone, their memories will never fade. This school's always going to live to us. It's not, it is, it's not gone. The building, the structure that house the memories is gone, but not, but not the memories. They've come back alive. This is how we remember things. It's, sometimes it takes something bad to happen for us to remember. The building had been vacant for about two years. Students were moved at that time to Hooven Elementary. Investigators are still looking at the cause of the fire. It's been a beautiful Saturday to get in some early spring yard work. The sun's been bright all day. As for tonight, Jeff is here with No Wait Weather. Jeff. Well, it's going to get cold tonight. Clear skies about the area and high pressure and light winds mean that temperatures tonight are going to fall. And in some places, we will fall down to around that freezing march, which means that by morning, there could be some patchy frost. In fact, there is a frost advisory in effect, basically from Metro Cincinnati to the south. If you live Hamilton County, if you live Dearborn County, if you live Claremont County, everybody south of there has that uh, frost advisory in effect until 9 o'clock tomorrow morning. Clear skies out there right now. Uh, disturbance well off to the south and west will not make it in here. In fact, high pressure will continue to build in over the next few days, and that just means more sunshine. Live Precision Doppler 12 HD. That's a clean sweep. Nothing going on there. Mild right now, 58 at the airport, 59 at Lunkin, 57 in Hamilton, Wilmington right now, 55 degrees. By 9 o'clock, we're down to 49. So once that sun sets, will fall down fairly quickly on temperature. 42 by midnight, mostly clear and chilly by the time you wake up tomorrow morning. Relatively quiet over the next seven days. A bit warmer each and every day. We'll talk about that and your planning forecast all coming up in just a couple of minutes. Paula, back to you. All right, thank you, Jeff. Airspace over much of Europe remains closed tonight because of an exploding volcano in Iceland. The situation has stranded passengers all over the world and is costing the airline industry at least $200 million a day. Terrell Brown has the latest. The volcano in Iceland just keeps spewing ash, and it's not expected to stop anytime soon. The huge plume has forced countries all across Europe to extend no-fly restrictions through the weekend. In the right conditions, the clouds of ash could be catastrophic to jet engines. Well, this is unprecedented uh, as far as we know here in um, London and everywhere in uh, England at the moment. Uh, to find ourselves affected by a volcano is, is pretty unusual. From Barcelona to Stockholm to Newark, New Jersey, the story is the same. Canceled flights, exhausted travelers. I'll be three or four more days on my travel than, than original plan, so it's, it's a big disruption. President Obama can't even avoid the problem. He spent the morning watching his daughter's soccer game and will remain in Washington after canceling his trip to Poland for the funerals of President Lech Kaczynski and his wife. Airlines and travel agencies across the U.S. are working overtime to deal with the hundreds of thousands of stranded passengers. What's complicating the issue is that it's not clear when it will end. And there you go. Hundreds of Europeans scheduled to run in the Boston Marathon on Monday may miss the event. They're either sitting at an airport now, stranded, or they, their flight was canceled outright and they don't know when it's going to be rescheduled. This is the worst travel disruption the world has ever seen, except during times of war. In New York, Terrell Brown, Local 12. It is living history in action today as members of a local Boy Scout troop move a step closer toward becoming Eagle Scouts. Scouts became Civil War soldiers for the day and set up camp outside the Northwest Community Church just in front of the Colerain High School. The reenactment was part of an Eagle Scout project. It offered families an insight into a soldier's day-to-day -day activities during the Civil War. Antique replicas were on display, and generals Ulysses S. Grant and Robert E. Lee rode on horseback throughout the grounds today. The education, you know, we get it in class, we get it in school, but uh, having a little bit of outside living a living history, you know, if you come out and see people in the uniforms, doing the stuff, shooting the cannons, see the tents and what actually happened, really, you know, kind of makes it a lot more real, a lot more, a lot more relevant. 
As part of an Eagle Scout project, today's event was the culmination of some of the young men's scouting careers. A local community comes together to help the veterans with a chili fundraiser. How they are helping to make sure the soldiers' sacrifices are memorialized in granite next. Plus, meet Snoopy and the rest of the Peanuts gang. We take you to the newest addition to Kings Island. With all-wheel drive and electronic stability control, the new 2010 Chrysler 300 can sense when to follow the driver and when to take the lead. And the 300's multi-displacement system can sense when to deliver Hemi V8 power and when to offer V6 fuel efficiency. The new Chrysler 300, engineered to keep driver and car in perfect step. Now, well-qualified lessees can lease select luxurious Chrysler 300 touring models for just $289 a month. I am an advisor who will work to earn your trust. I am an innovator who will bring new thinking to the table. I am a negotiator who will always have your best interest in mind. I am a professional with a wealth of knowledge to share. Above all else, I am a person of integrity. I am Coldwell Banker Wes Shell. Contact me today. I'm at CBWS.com. It is what it is. It's Sims Furniture Sale of Sales. Today, save up to 50% on name brand furniture. Don't rent your large screen TV or appliances. Buy at Sims. Second chance credit. Rebuild your credit at Sims. Credit in a minute. Help keep Cincinnati beautiful at Cincinnati Fashion Week, April 19th through the 24th. Six days of fashion-focused events and shows, local and international designers, and Cincinnati's top models. Proceeds benefit Keep Cincinnati Beautiful. For more information, visit CWCincinnati.com. Get it right now. Instant access to the stories and links you first saw on Local 12. And more local news and invite to bring initiative rather to bring gardening back to the urban core of the city. Community members gathered at a groundbreaking ceremony for a new community garden in Mount Auburn. It's at the corner of Auburn Avenue and Mason Street. The land was donated by Christ Hospital. Plots in the community garden are free for any resident of Mount Auburn who enjoys growing produce or who has an interest in learning about the growing process. The smell of homemade chili brought hundreds out to support area veterans. The Delhi Township Veterans Association held an all-you-can-eat chili fundraiser this afternoon at the Delhi Senior Center on Neeb Road. The Veterans Association is very close to having enough money for an addition to the Wall of Honor at Veterans Memorial Park. The monument has the names of more than 1,900 veterans engraved on it, and it's full, so another wall is needed to accommodate more names. If you like today, Jeff says get ready for some more sunshine. He has that in his hour by hour forecast. Plus, get ready for Planet Snoopy. Kings Island has a new kids area in the park. We give you a preview next. Cricket knows you need coverage in all 50 states. We also know you need a smaller phone bill. That's why we've expanded our new nationwide coverage to reach every single state. And it's still just half the price of Verizon and AT&T. New unlimited nationwide calling, plus just 30 bucks a month, adds up to a whole new kind of respect. So you can pay half the price and have all the fun. Plus, right now, save $40 on this messaging phone. Now just $99.99. Call, click, or come in today and get even more respect for your wallet. Cricket. At Donato's, we believe a perfect crust is the foundation for a great pizza. We use fresh eggs, milk, flour, and real yeast. Cornmeal adds texture and makes the crust more tender. These specially designed pans help air circulate. So you get that golden crispy crust every time. So when it comes out of the oven, you can hear it snap. You'll know that it's Donato's when you taste the crust. Taste what makes Donato's great from the crust to the toppings. Like our fresh mozzarella pizzas. Right now, any large is just $12.99. Donato's. The difference is delicious. Keep doing what you've always done. The Lexus RX. Never has a vehicle been designed to feel so natural. See Performance Lexus in the King's Auto Mall and Lexus River Center in Covington. Going to court for a worker's compensation, personal injury, or social security claim can feel like you're about to take part in a full contact sport. That's why it's important to have a law firm that understands what it takes to win in your corner. Call Casper and Casper today.
It is what it is. It's Sims Furniture Sale of Sales. Today, save up to 50% on name brand furniture. Don't rent your large screen TV or appliances. Buy at Sims. Second chance credit. Rebuild your credit at Sims. Credit in a minute. Pinpointing traffic issues before you head out the door. Traffic alerts on Good Morning Cincinnati. You can tell summer is just around the corner. Today is opening day at Kings Island. The park unveiled its new theme, Peanuts. Planet Snoopy is open for kids. We found some kids stopping for a photo op with Snoopy, while Charlie Brown greeted other park guests. Also, it was a good chance to ride through the air with Snoopy as he takes on the Red Baron, or take a ride in the Peanut 500 in pint-sized cars around the expressway. For now, the park is closed tomorrow, but then it's open weekends until Memorial Day. Then it is open every day this summer. The International Butterfly Show opens this weekend at the Crone Conservatory. Butterflies of all colors fluttered around today, greeting visitors inside the showroom. You could see young children eager to get a butterfly to land on them. It is such a fun event. This year's show highlights the beauty and heritage of Japan. Butterflies in free flight are all sur also surrounded by a Japanese garden. The show is open daily from 10 to 5 until June 20th. Another display of beautiful colors this weekend, the Cincinnati Flower Show. For the second year in a row, it's at Sims Township Park. If you don't have a green thumb, you don't have to worry. There are exhibits there for everyone with displays to inspire your inner gardener. Vendors are also set up selling all types of plants, gardening tools, decorations, so much more. The Flower Show is on Lebanon Road between West Loveland Avenue and Fields Erdle Road. It is open daily through April 25th, so you have a lot of time to check it out. That's a fun event, too, and what a great day for the the flower show today. Wow, absolutely gorgeous. Temperatures topping out at about 60 degrees, lots of sunshine. And after a cold start tomorrow morning, we should see a nice rebound as well. I don't see any reason why we don't make it to about 60 tomorrow afternoon as well. Out to Anderson Township we go. Beach Acres Park early this morning. The uh, Little League Parade, 850 players, 72 teams moving through that park at uh, about, right. about 9 to about 10 30 this morning. And it was kind of a chilly start this morning. They probably were doing that in the uh, low 40s or so. But look at that. Plenty of sunshine. Nice to get out. Little League season has started. And I remember the days when I used to sit out in center field and chew on the grass. High pressure. <laughs> yeah. Just, you know, you just stick a blade yeah. of grass in your okay. mouth and you just wait for the ball to come to you. <laughs> High pressure building in. That means more sunshine. Weeks end, we may see a little bit of uh, rainfall, but until then, we're dry. And for the first couple of days, we're going to start a little on the chilly side. That frost advisory in effect. If you live in Ripley, Dearborn, Hamilton County, Claremont County, Brown County, Adams County, even Highland County, and areas south, that frost advisory in effect until 9 o'clock tomorrow morning. Portions of Indiana, that's a freeze warning. They will drop down to at least 32 degrees, if not colder, after about 2 o'clock this morning. For us, we'll see some patchy frost about the area and may see uh, some of that tomorrow morning as well. Live Precision Doppler 12 HD, nothing going on right there because we have clear skies out there right now. It's an absolutely beautiful night with temperatures right now still in the upper 50s everywhere. 58 at the airport, 59 at Lunkin, 57 in Hamilton. Wilmington checking in right now at 55 degrees. Winds out of the west northwest is 16. That's going to keep funneling that cool air in here. But notice that dew point all the way down to 20. It's a very dry air mass and so that that means that once the sun falls tonight, once it sets, we will see that air mass cool down very quickly, at least initially. 58 right now. By 9 o'clock, we'll be down to 49. 42 by midnight, mostly clear and chilly by morning. There's Cincinnati right there. Departing low pressure. That's going to keep a little bit of cloud cover from Columbus, maybe into the Dayton area uh, late tomorrow. But for the most part, tomorrow we have clear skies and we'll have those clear skies overnight. In fact, Precision Cast doing a pretty nice job with this. We'll start this at midnight. There's departing low pressure. And that counterclockwise spin around that low pressure, you can see some of those clouds trying to work their way in, but mainly clear skies overnight, clear skies tomorrow as well, clear to partly cloudy. So 8 o'clock tomorrow morning as you head off to church, you'll need those sunglasses. And through the day tomorrow, maybe a few high thin clouds, but still a very nice day. Notice across the northern plains, we're starting to see that high pressure build in. It's going to slowly build in. So the first couple of days here, we'll have those cool starts to the day. We'll have mild afternoons as we get into Monday morning. Clouds break, and as we move through the day on 
Monday. Lots of sun for your daytime on Monday. Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday right now. Looking very nice as high pressure continues to move off to the south and east. Tonight, lows dropping down anywhere from about 32 in Connorsville and Hamilton to about 34 in Fairfax. Lawrenceburg, Versailles, you'll bottom out at about 33 or so. 35 down in Springdale, Mount Olivet, you'll see a morning low of about 35 as well. We'll be back to 53 by noon, a daytime high of 60. We'll start with that patchy early frost. Otherwise, sky is clear to partly cloudy. Here's your planning forecast. Looking at the next few days, we do bust that 70 mark as we uh, as we get into uh, as we get into uh, Thursday. 69 for uh, Wednesday. Thursday, we're at about uh, 70, 72 for Friday, and those showers and thunderstorms moving in for Friday and for Saturday as well. So cool start tomorrow. Another cool start on Monday, but not that frosty cool start. Yeah. And then sort of stair climbing our way up towards 70 by the end of the week. Okay. So very pleasant. Yeah. Another extended dry stretch. Um, for those that don't get their things planted this week, not a good day to do it today because yeah. of tomorrow. Um, but as we move through the next couple of days, very nice. Wow. I, you know, I've been on vacation. I come back to great weather and I left great weather. I should have stayed. You should have stayed. <laughs> yeah, because it rained in Hawaii from what I understand. Yes, it did. <laughs> But it was still good. I wasn't going to say that, but okay. I had to. I'm not whining. The, <laughs> the Bengals are gearing up for the first few rounds of the NFL draft. Details ahead. And the Reds' top pitching prospect takes the mound in a AAA game today. Tara has that story next in sports. Are you ready for even more Ram Truck Month? Are you ready for a Hemi V8 upgrade at no extra charge plus 0% financing? Are you ready to haul bigger, pull harder, and work smarter? All in refined comfort and style. Be ready in a Ram 1500, the most awarded Ram truck ever. Ram. Now during Truck Month, well-qualified lessees can lease Ram 1500 Quad ST 4x4 for just $279 a month. After all the errands my boss just sent me on, I've got 12 minutes left for lunch. Uh, I get 20 minutes, if I'm lucky. I'm guessing about 15 minutes. Today, I'm already late. At Speedway, we know you don't have much time for lunch. So when you're on the go, make sure your lunch is too. Out of here in record time. Speedway has great hot food choices every day. From quesadillas and cheeseburgers to our new fire dogs. Two for just $2. We're on your way. The convenience stores of Speedway. We are Local 12 News. Breaking news alerts. Current, urgent information. Every night at 11. We care. Because we live and work here too. I, I grew, grew up, up here. here. We have experience. And commitment to this community. We deliver important news the minute it happens. Breaking news alerts. From the people you trust. We are Local 12 News. Every night at 11. Any way you slice it, Papa John's has better ingredients, better pizza. Better ingredients, better pizza is not a slogan. It is a way of life. Papa's in the house. Now you get it all for just $10. Your choice of pizzas, your choice of toppings, any large, even specialty pizzas like the works and the meats, just $10. Your choice of pizzas, your choice of toppings, just $10. Call or order online to get Pointing traffic issues before you head out the door. Traffic alerts on Good Morning Cincinnati. Good evening, everyone. We'll start with a stat. Unfortunately, not a good one. After 11 games, the Reds remain the only major league team that doesn't have a single starting pitcher with a victory. It's Johnny Cueto's turn to try and change that stat as the Reds get ready for round two against the Pirates. Pirates in Pittsburgh tonight. Araldis Chapman makes his pitching debut in Louisville today. He goes five innings, giving up one hit, one run with four walks and one strikeout. It takes the $30 million man 28 pitches to get out of the first inning, 62 pitches to get through three innings. However, Chapman does exceed 100 miles per hour twice and hits 99 miles per hour twice. On ESPN Radio this afternoon, NFL analysts Mel Kuyper Jr. and Todd McShay conducted a mock draft with each selecting every other player. For the Bengals at number 21, McShay selected Oklahoma tight end Jermaine Gresham, and that was with wideout Des Bryant still available. The Bengals, however, focused on more than their first pick. You know, I think I make the opportunity to have four picks uh, in the first 96 picks is uh, also kind of speaks to us having an opportunity at 21 and 54 
uh, to gain players that I believe will uh, have an impact somewhere in the early part of our season on uh, at some point uh, on one side of the ball or the other. Um, and then the, uh, the additional guys later on as we fill them in uh, to continue to, to add both depth and competition and, uh, and have an opportunity to impact again what we do. Uh, very similar, hopefully, to what last year's class did. You've heard Marvin's thoughts on the draft. Tomorrow, hear Marty's thoughts. Former UC receiver and NFL hopeful Marty Gilliard will join me on the Sports Authority to discuss the draft process. Tune in Sunday night at 11.35 to hear what he has to say. And don't forget, we show viewer picks on the Authority every Sunday night, so share your snapshots with us. Simply send pictures of you, your friends, or your family participating in an athletic event to sports at local12.com. We'll post your pictures on the web, too. And good news for Reds fans, Joey Votto is back in the lineup tonight. He had a little bit of the flu yesterday. Yeah. Scott Rowland is still sick, so Miguel Cairo will take over third, but hopefully he'll be better soon. Yeah, I too. heard a lot of allergies, huh? They're yeah, lots like of allergies else. going on. They're, they're normal people, those baseball players, <laughs> just that? like you and me. <laughs> All right, thank you, Tara. We'll be right back with a final check of the forecast. You see breaking news happening. Call Local 12 at 579 1212. If you're late to pick up your kids from soccer practice, the 368 horsepower Hemi V8 Charger is perfect. The Grand Caravan is great if you have five kids. And the all-wheel drive V6 Journey is perfect if you are late in picking up your five kids from soccer practice and practices in Peru. It's your choice. Now, well-qualified lessees can lease the award-winning Journey SE for just $2.59 a month. Cricket knows you need coverage in all 50 states. We also know you need a smaller phone bill. That's why we've expanded our new nationwide coverage to reach every single state. And it's still just half the price of Verizon and AT&T. New unlimited nationwide calling, plus just 30 bucks a month, adds up to a whole new kind of respect. So you can pay half the price and have all the fun. Plus, right now, save $40 on this messaging phone. Now just $99.99. Call, click, or come in today and get even more respect for your wallet. Cricket just a typical family. We have our battles, tangles, tears, but on the important things, we all agree. Life is full of surprises. You may as well face your fears. It's okay to let yourself go once in a while. Sooner or later, every dog has his day. Silence is golden. And this year, we're going back to Gatlinburg. On my desk when I get in. <sighs> the carpool. I do it for the open lane, not the company. But somehow, just opening the sky slider roof in my Jeep Liberty is all I need to open everyone's mind. My Jeep Liberty. It lets me enjoy the ride. Now, well qualified lessees can lease a fuel efficient Liberty Sport 4x4 for just $309 a month. I live, I ride, I am. Jeep. I love seeing the sun. Uh, very pleasant overnight, but cold by morning. Frost advisory in effect until 9 a.m. tomorrow for Metro Cincinnati, Hamilton County South. We're at 58 right now, 42 by midnight. We'll start at around 34 tomorrow, take it back up to 60. Okay, not bad. All right, the CBS Evening News is next. We'll see you at 11. Good night. The highest possible crash safety rating. Up to 460 uninterrupted highway miles. Providing America's best coverage and two Consumers Digest Best Buy Awards. Buick Enclave and La Crosse. We're going to need more gold stars. Now get a 2010 La Crosse for just $26,995. The new class of world class. Buick La Crosse. See your tri-state Buick dealer. Looking for a gift for that special person in your life? Get more for your money at Cleves & Lahneman Jewelers, located in Bellevue, Kentucky's historic Fairfield Avenue Business District. A trip to Cleves & Lahneman will be a unique shopping experience. Cleves & Lahneman offers more than fine jewelry and vintage watches. They also specialize in custom-designed engagement rings and expert restoration of those precious heirlooms and family treasures. You might even see the fifth generation at Cleves & Lahneman Jewelers, creating satisfaction since 1932. Going to court for a worker's compensation, personal injury, or social security claim can be as intimidating as playing hardball in the big leagues. That's why it's important to have a law firm that knows how to win on your team. Casper and Casper, the difference between winning and losing. 
Thanks, Toyota, for extending your best offers ever. 0% financing has been extended on all the most popular 2010 Toyota models. Take advantage of the best 36-month lease offers ever. Lease this brand new 2010 Corolla LE for only $149 per month. At King's Toyota, we offer shopping in the most outrageous 170-car indoor showroom, upfront pricing on a 1,000 new Toyotas, and free oil changes and car washes for life. King's Toyota is located in the King's Auto Mall. Thanks again, Toyota. Your offers are downright outrageous. Help keep Cincinnati beautiful at Cincinnati Fashion Week, April 19th through the 24th. Six days of fashion-focused events and shows, local and international designers, and Cincinnati's top models. Proceeds benefit Keep Cincinnati Beautiful. For more information, visit CWCincinnati.com. An hour by hour for...